The facilities department is located in Jefferson Barracks in a former building that was used as a military hospital in the early 1900s. The Melville School District acquired the property in the early 60s and served as an elementary school, then became the current home of the facilities department in 1967 where we perform all buildings and ground services. The department is staffed with various trades and skills to provide the most efficient, effective service possible while minimizing classroom disruptions. The staff prides themselves in quick, effective, and timely responses to any and all challenges to ensure a seamless educational environment for all students and staff. Our custodians clean a total floor space of over 1.8 million square feet, each cleaning an average of over 19,000 square feet per day. In addition, we support over 5,000 building usage requests that take place during the evenings and weekends. The maintenance department maintains the equivalent footprint of 1,000 average size homes each day, 320 acres of ground, and completes an average of 7,500 work requests per year. In addition, we monitor over 16,000 points of control for our HVAC energy management system to ensure a comfortable climate controlled learning environment. We track our services using an internet management system called SchoolDude, which allows us to monitor the efficiency of workers, work orders, supplies used, and to track problem items. We continue to build our preventive maintenance system program to lower operating costs and keep our buildings functioning as intended with limited disruptions. The department's overall budget as compared to the district as a whole has been consistent over the past several years with the exception of the five-year facilities plan that was implemented in 2012. The five-year plan was designed to add capital funds into the facility budget to help address those areas in need and some of the major projects completed in the first year of the plan were the replacement of gym divider walls at Berkeley, Oakville Senior High, and Melville Senior High. We are able to replace the old gym divider walls with a safer, much more reliable drop-down gym divider curtains. The new gym dividers will give our students, staff, and visitors a more reliable option for utilizing limited gymnasium space. In addition, we replaced the roof at the Witzel Learning Center with a new 25-year warranty TPO LEED certified roof. The old roof at the Witzel Center was in very poor condition and well beyond its life expectancy, leaking in several locations and causing damage to the interior space. The new roof will provide our students and staff with a safer, much more secure environment while stabilizing the integrity of the inside of the building. Another project was the installation of a new fire alarm at Melville Senior High. The old fire alarm consisted of a variety of interacting field devices from different manufacturers, required a large amount of maintenance, and was well beyond the life expectancy of a fire alarm system. The new system has the latest code compliant regulations per the Melville Fire Department and will provide our students and staff and visitors with a state-of-the-art fire alarm system for years to come. Woolen Elementary also received a new VCT gym floor this past summer, replacing the old floor that had multiple replacement patches and frequently experienced loose tiles, causing unsafe playing conditions for students and visitors. Also, we perform various asphalt maintenance district-wide, including overlays, patching, sealing, and striping. The yearly asphalt maintenance work is a critical part of the preventive maintenance cycle that helps prevent costlier future repairs and provide safer playing surfaces for our students. In addition to the projects that were completed in year one of the five-year plan, other projects that were completed or will be completed in 2013 are the installation of solar panels, Berkeley kitchen renovation, tennis facility at Bernard Middle, and a new auditorium at Melville High School. The solar panel project consisted of a 25 kW solar panel array on roof of five schools, the Witzel Learning Center, Beasley, Hageman, Bernard Middle, and Oakville Senior High. The project construction started in September of 2012 and was completed in early December by a company by, by the name of Straight Up Solar. The project was fully commissioned and generating free solar power starting January 1, 2013. The Berkeley kitchen renovation was completed during the 2012 summer and fully operational for the start of the school year. The old kitchen was full of non-functioning equipment and not conducive to student flow. The new kitchen allows for adequate space for food preparation, student flow which allows for students to get through meal lines faster and overall increased operational efficiency. The construction of the tennis facility at Bernard Middle started in October of 2012 and is scheduled for completion this spring. It will include eight new courts, including four that will be marked for junior play. The facility will be the new home court for both Oakville and Melville High Schools and also will be used by our community members as well. I'm really excited. It's going to be nice and it's going to be a good change to have for the program. 
I'm excited, you know, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be a lot of fun. The new auditorium building that is being constructed on the Melville campus will allow the Melville School District, for the first time in its history, to host large-scale events for instructional and performance activities at a district-owned facility. The state-of-the-art auditorium, with theater-style seating, audio-visual components, programmable lighting, and video recording infrastructure, has been acoustically designed for multi-purpose venues district-wide. Construction began in the fall of 2012 and is scheduled for completion by November 1, 2013. The training for the arts will be much better. They will be able to compete for scholarships uh, in technical theater in a way they've never been able to before. They will be able to compete more effectively in acting uh, types of performance scholarships. Some of the projects that will be taking place this summer in year two of the five-year facility plan include fire alarm replacement at Oakville Senior High, Rogers Elementary, and Beasley Elementary, restroom renovation at the pool facility, asphalt maintenance district-wide, and bleacher replacement at Washington Middle, Oakville Middle, and Berkeley Middle School. Our program challenges are to continue to identify opportunities to acquire additional funding to implement newer technologies to better serve the students, staff, and community. We also would like to develop an HVAC equipment replacement schedule that will allow us to systematically replace old, inefficient, and obsolete systems on a planned schedule, minimizing failures that affect climate and the learning environment. Our primary goal in facilities is to provide a safe, clean, and comfortable learning environment for all students and staff, keep all physical plant systems operating efficiently and reliably, and to minimize interruptions in the learning process.